Hey YouTube, it's Awana Turtle, and today we're going to be opening some more Dominaria. Uh, it's a bit of a, not the newest set, but still really fun. Uh, if you haven't checked out, we just opened up a bundle. Uh, if you haven't seen that video, definitely check it out. We got a, some crazy cards. Uh, as far as, you know, what you can get in 10 packs, I think it's about as good as it can get. If you haven't seen it, check it out. And we're going to see if we can't reproduce that. Um, so we do have 10 blisters here. So they're not from, not all from the same package. Uh, this is back again from that GameStop deal. So each of these were only like two bucks. Then that happened around the holidays. So I'm just gonna keep, see if we can't reproduce that bundle again. I'll give you a hint. It was a Planeswalker. And he's pretty expensive right now. And hopefully, uh, we're gonna have some Ravnica Legion soon. I, I realized the other day that I've been calling it Alliance. For some reason, I thought it was Alliance and not Allegiance. And uh, so, we're gonna be opening some of that in the near future as well. But until then, let's see if we can't pull some good cards from Dominaria. Let's see. Mind, we both pulled a couple Liras. Uh, obviously, they have the. the Two color lands where you have the basic already so I wouldn't mind some more of those like <laughs> here we go woodland cemetery very strong start on that there's a <laughs> there's that safari definitely want more of him all right Memorial of Genius. Gaia's Blessing. Whoa, oh my gosh. Oh man. We keep keep pulling like some of the best cards. All right, History of Banalia. So first you create a couple two twos and then they all get plus two plus one. Yeah, I think that was one of the best cards as well. Man, I feel like just been very fortunate recently. Some of our pulls. All right, right. Second pack. Very strong mythic. All right, let's keep it going. I guess I'll hollow there. Foil. Sage of Latnam. The, whatever. All right, the Marari Conjecture, and then the Pride of Firmirth. Okay, let's keep going. Alright, we got the Untamed Kavu. Memorial Folly. Dampening Sphere, nice. And then Amarin the Nurturer. Alright, so far we got one of the special lands and a very good Saga Mythic. Alright. Another memorial of genius. Board the Weatherlight. Drew Aura's familiar. And then a Jin of the Lamp. Was there ever a good, like, a uh, Jin? I'm not aware of one. <laughs> if there was, let me know what it was. I feel like whenever I just see that, like, Dijin, I'm not even sure if I'm pronouncing that right. It's kind of a weird word, but it's just a. Uh, I associate it with just a terrible card. Ooh, there we go. Hinterland Harbor. Second rare land. Nice. Although I usually have the same association with the Hydras. Although the Ravnica Allegiance Hydra is, as of right now, the most expensive card of the set. That one is 
the first one that I'm aware of that has a draw engine to it. Gives life too, but I don't think that's the point. All right, we got, ooh. Knocking over piles recently. recently. All right, we got Knight of Grace, Goblin Barrage, Tempest Dijin, another Dijin, great. All right, we got three packs left. Lingering Phantom. Knight of Malice. Ooh, Foil Rare. Lich's Matching. Uh, Mastery. Pretty cool. Oh, man, yes. And another Mythic. From So, so far we've opened eight loose packs. We got a Foil Rare. We got another Mythic in Yurik's Bladewing. And then the other one was the Rare, the Mythic Saga. Very strong opening so far. We got two packs left. All right, lingering phantom again. Merfolk trickster. That's actually one of the better ones. Isolated chapel. Yes. All right. So we got three, <laughs> three of the lands. What do you guys prefer? Lands that can come into play untapped for taking damage or the shock lands or the ones where you need the basic um, I imagine it just depends on what kind of deck you're running um, But if you if you had to pick one Which way would you lean? Urza's Tome Orca's Vandal and then for the last pack the Four Bears Blade All right to recap We did have a foil rare in Lich's Magist ah, Mastery. Why do I keep saying that? For the lands, we got an isolated chapel, second one in Hinterland Harbor, and then a third Woodland Cemetery. Very nice. Mythics. Again, this is just 10 packs, guys. So from 10 packs, we got a Varric's Bladewing Mythic, and then the History of Banalia. Very nice. And uh, so, just a reminder, you know, we're going to be uh, getting into some Ravnica Allegiance very soon, once once I can get the boxes in the mail. And so, if you do want to catch those, uh, definitely subscribe to the channel so you can get notified of when those come out. Uh, if you did enjoy the content, please drop a like, it would help a lot. And, you know, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll catch you guys next time. Later.